Um, let me see. Um, what, what was that? Oh, I wanted to tell you, I went to see this movie Split. Have you heard of that movie? Uh, no. What did it get on Rotten Tomatoes? I don't know. Maybe you could look it up. I I, I don't go by Rotten Tomatoes anymore, as you know. That anyway, doesn't make any sense. It was. Uh, <laughs> I've told you twice Why that I don't care what yeah, Rotten Tomato not, says. Well, it's yeah. not Rotten. You, you you're trying to say it's like what, what Rotten Tomato says. Right. Rotten Tomatoes is a collection of average. <laughs> it's a bunch of critics, and it's it's an average. So if like a if, if you say like, let's look at it this way, if you asked a hundred people if they wanted to go should I, should I go see this movie, and forty five percent say yes, right. and fifty five percent say no. Are you going to go are you engage and go say and go see the movie? Yes or no? If you want to see it, I will see what the subject matter is about, and if I like it, I'll go see it, or I'll ask somebody that I know that I know I like their taste. Okay, well, so me and Disco we'll go to me and Disco go to Rotten Tomatoes. In this case, for you, here's the thing. I like I told you before when when we were discussing Spirit Squad or whatever that movie what was it called the Suicide Squad Suicide Squad. The Rotten Tomato buried it. You buried it. KG didn't like it either. So am I supposed to go on you guys? No, no. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. So, it's not, it's, 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 you keep saying like Rotten Tomatoes buried it. So Rotten Tomatoes <laughs> didn't bury it. A bunch of critics. Everyone buried it. A yeah. bunch of critics buried it. All right. Okay. And, <laughs> all, and all the fans. That's, yeah, and, I liked, like, uh, and I liked it. So okay. what does that mean? You guys are right and I'm wrong. Well, I enjoyed it. So I guess I'm, you, I can yeah. You have you bad have taste, poor right? taste in movies. Yes. Uh, well, that that's up for debate. Like I said, I enjoyed it. <laughs> Split, so you know, on the tomato meter, it got seventy three percent, and from the audience, it got eighty two percent. Okay, so that would be good. You can go see that. I'll right. see that. Right. Well, um, uh, um, they had this guy there called James McAvoy. You remember him from uh, Professor uh, Professor X and the X Men? Uh, James McAvoy. Yeah. What you, was he? The guy that played the young. Uh, uh, the young um, what you call Doctor Xavier in the X Men? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, he he was um uh this was one of those Night Shyamalan. Remember him, Night Sham Shyamalan or whatever his name is. And Night Shyamalan film, really? Yeah. Yes. yes. Oh, and you wow. know how you know how after he made Sixth Sense, they were always like, "Well, this is going to be a great one," and it wasn't. And like he did like four or five in a row that were pretty brutal. Right. And uh, well, he came back around with this one. It's it was it was good. I thought it had like. The guy had like twenty three personalities, uh, pretty creepy, and then like each personality had like uh, mannerisms and different accents, and uh, it was very creepy. There's one personality who's called the Beast. You will love this one. I won't spoil it, but I like the movie. 